time to wake up, sleepyhead. Mum, I don't feel so well. I guess this means no school for you today. As I drifted off to sleep, everything was as it should be, and then suddenly it wasn't. Oh my lord, what was that? Chester, what's that? I don't think I like the look of this. Do you want to come out and play? Alice, run! Chester and I ran as fast as we could to the bathroom before locking ourselves in. Chester, when did you learn to talk? I'm afraid we have bigger fish to fry than that. I know. Let's climb out the window. The street appears deserted. Not for long, I'm afraid. I never imagined I'd be running from zombies while my mother was away at work. Danger seemed to lurk everywhere in this nightmarish landscape. Chester was my guide, helping me navigate this nightmarish world filled with creepy creatures. Together, we would find a way out or die trying. Who's there? Alice, I was wondering where you wandered off to. Chester, run! Those guys don't give up easy, do they? Since the streets weren't safe, there was only one place we could go. Come on, Chester. If we head into the woods, we'll be safe. Are you sure about this, Alice? No, but it's better than staying on the streets. Then, as we rounded the next bend, we saw it. I wonder what that is. I don't know. Let's see what happens if we walk through it. As soon as I stepped through the portal, everything started to spin. Then I found myself back in my bedroom, which was now zombie-free. Feeling better? That means it's back to school with you tomorrow. Thank goodness that was all just a bad dream. You think?